good morning and welcome back to the channel it's an exciting day today guys we're gonna go and pick my mum up from the airport and then um, we're gonna stay in Varna actually we're gonna go to the mall we're gonna go out for dinner so I am actually about to train first I've been up since very early I did manage to finish writing two training plans uh, so that I can sort of revise them over the next few days I need to write one more but I probably will do that so when my mum is here I've done all of my emails, I cleaned my bathroom, I walked the dogs but they didn't really want to walk. So all I have to do now is I'm gonna just eat my cottage cheese before training. Train, it's upper body. I will take you with me because I don't think I filmed an upper body in a long time so I'll take that. Uh, I'll film some of that and um, yeah basically when I get back I just need to have a shower and I need to hoover and mop the floors. And then I'm back and ready to go to Varna. So we'll leave it at, I'll leave it around one o'clock because my mum arrives at three and the airport is just slightly outside of Varna. So yeah, that's basically it. So like, I'm gonna make my breakfast now. And uh, yeah, we'll get going. Oh, I didn't weigh myself this morning and my weight is up, which like I gained literally one and a half kilos overnight, which is strange because I've actually been quite good with food this week. Uh, I did eat some cream of rice yesterday, but my carbs were still under 50, so that's fine. Um, I think it's because I'm during my period, maybe, because that's the only explanation I have. And before, and I've also been uh, not been able to go to the toilet for about four or five days, something like that. Um, sometimes when I change my calories around, and especially in the run-up to my lady times, I get very constipated, like terribly constipated. Now, I did have a laxative last night, and that did help eventually earlier. Um, but I've not weighed myself since then because I've, I've been drinking a lot of water and coffee since then so my weight will have been all over the place But um, I'll have to wait and see if I do get my period soon What that uh, will do to my to my weight because I did manage to get down to 72.6 Over the last few days from being close to 74, but now I'm just on the 74 again, so But I know I haven't like cheated on my diet Or eating crap or anything like that. So it has to be just hormonally
princess. Hey, little princess. Let's go and look at my other princess. What is she doing? What is my other princess doing? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, what's wrong, Daisy? You don't like being on your own, huh? Is that what it is? Why do you look so sad for? Why do you look so sad for little Missy? Oh, such a little sad face. Did you guys miss each other? Is that what it is? Huh? Oh my gosh, you guys miss each other and you miss mummy. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, that's what it is, isn't it? <coughs> oh, wow, 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 wow. Oh, wow, 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 wow. So I've just come back, as you can tell. Uh, pretty good session, to be honest. I, yes, I need to eat something now, which is gonna be egg whites with peanut butter and whey protein and some frozen strawberries, raspberries, I mean. I'm, gonna, I'm basically gonna keep my calories pretty low um, and keto, well, except for raspberries, but what, negligible, pretty much. Because, obviously, when my mum comes later today, I well, I want to go out for dinner tonight basically so I want to save some calories for that that doesn't mean that I'm going to eat in excess because I, I don't want to uh, I am currently the weight that I lost after Christmas I've gained it back because I'm during my period so I don't want to add to that and feel even more bloated than what I do already uh, so I'm going to stick low carb which yesterday actually I did eat some carbs I had cream of rice I don't know if I said that already, but basically the diet that I said I was going to stick to, I've changed that already. Already, I haven't been doing an hour of cardio, I did that for two days, but then I dropped the water so there was no need to keep it up basically. I'm not going to do excess if I don't need to, because um, it's sorted. Anyway, uh, but yeah, basically I'm going to keep my calories fairly low, and uh, then eat some food, do the cleaning, do the packing, walk the dogs. I get going soon after that, really, basically. So, but first I need to pee. I've, I've had my lips done as well. I had the top up. So if you're wondering why they're blue, it's because I had my lips, my lip filler topped up. So that should be good to go now for like six months to a year. And I have my Botox on as well, which you won't be able to see yet. But uh, yeah, I had that done Monday. This, but I just really love this egg white sort of concoction with the uh, whey protein and then the berries. It's just like sweet and filling, tastes nice. So yeah, I'm just gonna eat this. Just try and do a little bit of work. But to be honest, I don't think I have a lot of time. I don't think I'll have a lot of time to do work now anymore. I mean, I did a lot of work this morning because the reality is, is that I want to have a shower. I need to pack, I need to clean it here. I need to walk the dogs, so. Um, doesn't leave an awful lot of time, to be honest. <laughs> Rosie, stop being a naughty girl. <laughs> Do we need to go for walkies, huh? I think that's it. <laughs> Hey, <laughs> pop, 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 Rosie. Hey, nay, leave the shoe. Come on, let's go for walkies, girls. Yes, 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 we're gonna go. <laughs> All right, so I am ready to go. I am running a little bit late, about half an hour, which is not the end of the world, but um, so I did get everything done that I needed to get done. I also packed my mum and myself some lunches, which I do need to put in a plastic bag because it's um, it's like I'm a bit worried if the Tupperware is gonna like leak, so I made both the chicken salad. Grab two forks as well, actually, because I was gonna eat, but I don't think I have time. I think what I'll do is uh, I need to go to the petrol station anyway, and then what I'll do is I'll get like some nuts there and a coffee. So. You're gonna go and see Grandma? Shall we go and see Grandma? Yeah, let's go and see Grandma! We've got a special guest, but I won't show her. She doesn't want to be shown. So, ugh. but I'm just at the airport. 
I'm gonna eat the salad. Well, we are both eating salad actually because I'm hungry and I need to go to the pet shop and uh, then we go to the apartment where we just bought the dogs. So it's uh, basically grilled courgettes, chicken, mm. pesto, artichokes and olives. Very nice. Yeah. Mm. Oh. <sighs> oh. We'll eat this, get going, and then I'll, uh, I'll be back in a bit. My mom came through with the goods. Look at this. Yeah, look at that. You can't see, but it's basically a pick and mix. All sour <laughs> and licorice. Mm. Thanks, Mum. Diet starts tomorrow. Oh. I legit love sour candies so much. Mm. Uh -huh. And these are my favorite. Alright, uh, she's ready now, guys, for her debut. <laughs> <laughs> We're just gonna walk out to get some dog food and to pop to the shop for some supplies. Mm. And then, uh, I don't really know. This is too distracting, though. Huh? This is too distracting, though. <laughs> <laughs> What are we doing, huh? You being a naughty girl? Are you being a little naughty girl, Daisy? Little naughty miss. All right, guys. So we're just going to go for dinner to this restaurant that does like lots of traditional Bulgarian food, things like pig ears and duck hearts and stuff like that. So I'm gonna. I haven't had that much food today. I've worked out my calories are around like 1,500, if even that, including the few bits of candy that I ate. But uh, yeah, I'm looking forward to having some skara, as they believe it. Grill, I believe that's what it's called, skara. Exciting times. So we're like in this sort of like traditional pub place, restaurant. It's not a pub really, it's a restaurant. And we've got wine and we've got like a ton of food coming, which is fine, wherever's left over, I'll just stay with me. Um, so we ordered a cold starter mix. We ordered uh, like, um, it's like pickles and sausage and stuff like that, a plate. <laughs> Uh, I got some pig ears, I got some duck liver, some beef tongue, some beef cheeks, and, and lamb head. <laughs> so I think that should be no, enough food. Just, <laughs> I'm hungry though. Okay. But uh, you know, whatever is, whatever is left, I'll just take it with me, so it's fine. That's like taking doggy bags is not weird here. In England, nobody ever does that. I think you probably can if you ask for it, it's just weird. But here in Bulgaria, it's not strange at all. People do that all the time. This is the starter. So we've got like a mix, so like little salads of things. And then we've got some food here, which apparently he's just explained to us that we need to have like one of everything on the gypsy bread. It is called gypsy bread, guys. I'm not, uh, I'm not saying things that I shouldn't say. Mm, those pickles are really good. Okay, so you're supposed to have some of the fat, some of the salad, a bit of everything apparently. And then you have a bite. You're supposed to have a bite with everything on it though. <laughs> Alright, my mom doesn't know how to take a bite with everything on it, so... Let me show you how to do this because, oh my god. Honestly, sometimes. Okay, so this is what she was supposed to do. Have a bite with everything on it. It's actually really fresh, quite oily though. But spicy but it's nice um i can't really taste the fat but i think it's probably because i didn't have that much of it but it's nice it's um just very pickly i have to say pickly sharp from the onions a bit sour a bit sweet it's nice let me try some of these here so here we've got the beef cheeks which is oh, i love beef cheeks very nice very tender 
as you would expect. Oh, actually, I think I had a bit of pork. I didn't have. A, I had a bit of mushroom there. Now I've got a bit of cheek I and mean, cheek and mushroom. Yeah. Melt in the mouth. Let's try some uh, head. Some lamb head. All right. So let's try some lamb head. Very fatty. But it's nice though. I think we're gonna have a bit of that uh, pickle to go with that. A little pickle to bite through the fat. Mm, that's a good deal. Let me try and see if I can get a bit that's a bit more meaty. Yeah, got a meaty bit. The thing is, the fat's been cooked for so long that it actually just melts in the mouth. And let's try a bit of beef tongue. It's very nice that beef tongue. Again, it's quite fatty, but it's to be expected for it to be fatty. Anyway, I'm going to enjoy this. Have a, a sip of wine, red wine. And then try and work through the whole of this food here. So these are the duck hearts. And that's the pig This is the duck hearts, yeah. This that's is the, the pig yard. So, this is the hoofd, the lama hoofd. Okay. Right, let's try some pig's ears, shall we? You must let it set up, Koi, mama. Okay. Alright, let's try some uh, pig ears. It's got a dip in it. It's a little chew. Mm. Very garlicky. Very garlicky. Very garlicky. Um, I don't know how to explain it. It's like the consistency of. It's definitely the consistency of what you would think ears would be like. Like a little chewy, a little jelly. It doesn't taste bad though. <coughs> What's your thoughts on the ear? Hmm? What's your thoughts on the ear? Never say never. I don't know. <laughs> Strange texture. Yeah, it's just like a bit. It's a bit. It's like a bit chewy. Yeah. But it's like jelly at the same time. It's not bad, but. So is there a stuff is better? Yeah, so the, so the duck hearts, they're very nice. Um, yeah, that's the beef cheeks. Beef tongue is very good too. It's all very nice to be honest. Finished eating, pretty much ate it all, almost. I'd say three quarters of it. Three quarters we ate, right? And I worked actually, I stuck it all on my fitness pal and I'm still pretty much under my calories for today. I'm a, if I'm under my calories for my maintenance, but I'm slightly over 2200, I'm 23 and a half, but my mate is 2700, so not bad. Um, but now we're just finishing a little bit of wine and then go back home and go to bed, I guess. So, what I'll do is I will end the vlog here. What emoji should they do? Uh, Bulgarian flag. There you go, Bulgarian flag emoji. If you don't know what it looks like, that's Google. 